September 2024, how to block ads on Twitch. I'll leave this link in the description and it basically just takes you here. What this is, is a text guide on how to block ads on Twitch. If you scroll up, there's a couple of recommended extensions that they recommend you to use. Each of these is an alternative method to block Twitch ads. But today what we'll be doing is this option down here that says uBlock Origin applying a script. So step number one is downloading uBlock Origin and installing it. So search it up like I did and then click on add extension, add extension. Once that's done, this will show up and it'll tell you it's installed. So then go into here to your extensions and pin it like this. That way the icon actually shows up here. If you don't do that, the icon won't show up permanently. Okay, so step number two is to click on the icon and then go down here onto this gear icon. This will say dashboard. At the top, there's a tab that says my filters up here. Click on this tab. Then we'll go back to the guide and right here it says my under my filters tab add this piece of text so we're going to take this copy and then we're going to paste this text right here make sure to click on apply changes to save your changes now the last step is to go over here to the settings tab and scroll all the way down then mark this checkbox that says i am an advanced user and then click on this icon that shows up now you're going to scroll all the way down there's a bunch of options here basically and we're going to change this value here for the user's resource location option. So go back into the guide and right here, they'll give you a really long link on the third step. So take this long link that they give you here, copy it, and then go back into the advanced settings and then delete this value and then paste the one you just copied. So it'll be the really long link. Once again, make sure to click on apply changes at the top here and then you're all said and done. They also recommend you to turn the extension on and off or to restart your browser. I'm just going to turn it off by clicking this button and then I'm going to turn it back on. You'd be surprised at how many tech problems are solved by this. And I'll assess it out. Okay, so right here at the top, you'll see it says blocking ads and the quality will be quite low. So the quality will go down to 480p, but you can hear the entire stream. Down. Enderburden, you got mad. I think I looked at him. Wow, You can hear the entire stream as normal, and you can see the chat and the whole video and everything. You'll just have this thing, like I said, that says blocking ads. So let's wait for that to finish. Once that finishes, the quality will go back up to normal. So yeah, you'll be able to watch through any ads, whether that's at the start of the stream or in the middle of the stream. Literally, the only downside is that the quality will go down to 480p while the ad is playing. But once it finishes blocking the ad, the quality will go back up to 1080p. But yeah, you're all set. All links will be in the description. And if this is outdated, just go back to this guide and maybe try out some of the other extensions. These are like alternative options that you can try. And yeah, if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. My mom would really appreciate it. We're trying to reach 300 subscribers. And I just post a bunch of horseshit, including link videos, but hey, 